shame. DSS was spotted begging Peter Obi instead of arresting him as demanded by Tunubu's aid. You see, this happened yesterday. Yesterday, I'm telling you, Tunubu uh, uh, aid Kenyamo, the spokesperson of the APC, called for the arrest of Peter Obi. Instructing the uh, the DSS to go and arrest him for treason and um, uh, 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 char uh, the charges for murder and all of that. Now the DSS going to uh, to effect his his call ended up going there to plead to plead to Peter Obi to calm down and tamper justice with mercy, begging Peter Obi. To redraw case and all of that, is that not a big shame? Because why? The the the, the, the DSS they know that there is no truth in what has just been revealed by Kestos Kiyamo. And if they go on by arresting Peter Obi, I tell you, my dear listeners, the worst will happen. Did you listen to what um, uh, the US president said concerning that? The U.S. president said that the worst will happen if Peter Obi is arrested. Abba, my people, you will be shocked to hear this now. You and I, we are in this country. You know, you know what transpired. You know what went wrong. Eh? So, let, let's quickly check the content, my dear listeners. This is Morning News. Labour Party presidential candidate Peter Obi has taken the Nigerian political scene by storm and despite coming third in the recently concluded presidential election, the support and the popularity of the former Anambra state governor has remained unshakable. But the leader of the obedient movement has certainly robbed opposition parties the wrong way as he heads to the presidential election petition tribunal debt to challenge the presidential election polls that brought about the emergence of Bola Ahmed Tunubu as the winner and president-elect of Nigeria. Festus Kiyamo, junior labor minister, would disclose on the evening of Thursday, March 23, 2023, that he had petitioned the Labour Party presidential candidates alongside his running mate, Dati Baba Ahmed, to the DSS, asking the Department of State Service to invite, harass both them for inciting Nigerian against the Buhari led administration. Despite the call to the DSS to the DSS for his arrest, Peter Obi seems to be unbothered as he reviewed few hours after the Kiamos petition went viral on social media that he was meeting with the Imo State Labour Party stakeholders and the governorship aspirants in an interactive meeting on the way forward in Imo State. Taking to his official Twitter handle, Peter Obi will disclose that I am grateful, I'm gratified that Barrister Julius Abure, the national chairman of the Labour Party, and I were able to meet with the Imo State Labour Party stakeholder and the governorship aspirants in an interactive meeting on the way forward in Imo State. He added that much ground remains to be covered ahead of the 10th April primaries. It is reassured that the participants agreed to remain constructively engaged and also work collectively towards a seamless and hitch free primaries. You see, it is politics. It is politics. You know, politics can do anything. Politics can do anything. So, what you see that is happening right now between Peter Obi, Festus Kiyamo, and um, Tunubu is politics. Festus Kiyamo is only trying to build fear, you know, so that Peter Obi will see reason to withdraw case because he's already making a headway in court. And the court is already seeing reason that Peter Obi have a victory. You understand? Um, well, that is by the way, anyway. Uh, my dear listeners, uh, I'm not surprised because 
a lot has really happened this period and a lot is still happening a lot is still happening so first of Kiyama, i don't really know what uh what to be in the destiny now that uh the dss has refused to effect your request uh what will be your next line of action hmm? all right let's quickly hear from you my dear people and let's know what your take What's your advice and what's your opinion on all that has just been said right now? Maybe. Don't forget to leave your comment below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated each time we upload any new videos. Thank you.